Hello everyone. So when you completely finish your InDesign layout, you are going to export it and upload it to this issue.com website so that you are able to see your book in book format online. And to do that, I'm going to go to my layout on InDesign. And I first need to go to File, Export. I want to export it this time as an Adobe PDF for print. Um, and re rename it whatever you want. Uh, and it should be saving into your period drive. You're going to keep all of these settings the same. Um, the one that could be different, um, make sure it's on pages instead of spreads. And then click export. And just click OK through all these things. OK. Um, so now I am going to go to issue.com. And I first need to sign up to make an account. And for some reason right now, that's not working for me. So to, to figure out like how I can actually sign up, um, I, I'm just going to do this weird thing. OK, and for you guys to sign up, you can sign up using your Gmail. I'm already a member, so I'm going to really quickly sign in. Okay, and now that we're here, um, what we want to do is click on this upload button um, to upload our PDF that we just downloaded. So I'm going to click upload and then select a file to get started. And I save my file into my period drive. Uh, and here it is. I'm going to click open. Great, and now I can change the title. Um, I can make a description. For publication visibility, we want it to be public so that you can share the link to this with me. And then click Publish Now. Uh, this doesn't matter, just, just click on one of them. Great, and now our booklet has been published. So to actually look at it, I'm gonna click on Publications List. And th th this was my previous example. This is the one that I just uploaded. To look at it, I'm going to click Open. And here is my new uploaded booklet, and it looks great. OK. Um, let's say that I uploaded it, and for some reason it looks really weird. I can go up to Publish and Publish your dashboard, um, and then Publication List. And that brings me back to all my books that I have uploaded. Let's say I want to delete a book for some reason. I can click the three dots, and then click Delete. Um, and when you have finished this, you're just going to click open um, and copy this URL up here, command C to copy, and turn in this URL as a link on Google Classroom to officially turn in your book. 